Miami's Little Haiti. Just a short trip from downtown, Little Haiti has become one of the city's artistic meccas. While artists like Serge Toussaint have become local legends in their own right, there's an even younger generation doing its part to contribute to the artistic reawakening of the area. Today, its walls are covered in murals and public art, and one of its most promising young talents is Haiti native Wolfgang Sonatas, aka Wolfgang Mosaic. Sonatas arrived from Port-au-Prince to Miami at the age of two, struggling through adolescence and even spending a period of time homeless. Today, he's one of the most promising young artists in the Miami art scene, lending a brush to Little Haiti and to up-and-coming neighborhoods like Wynwood, carrying with him a passion for Haiti and for expression. We caught up with him to talk about his art, his relationship with Haiti, and his love of Haitian-American artist Jean-Michel Basquiat. The birth of me, that's where I came, that's where I was imported from. So Haiti is not just a place as a canvas, or I could draw on Haiti due to what has been broadcast to society, we've been in that condition. Haiti has been in need of help. Haiti has been destroyed by its own people. So I feel as a Haitian, I myself, I'm young, so I have time to do something rather than those that have passed their years and wish that they could have, should have, would have, which is only a state of mind. And it's like, it's not your mind, it's your thoughts. So you have to defeat the battle if I can't. Basically, I'm just trying to touch the youth, trying to touch the world, but really I feel like it begins with the youth, because if I could reach the young minds, then hopefully they could reach to their parents or reach to the adults or their peers, which will grow up to become the adults that run our society. And the art is basically the language for those that can't understand basic words. I could draw a picture, I could write a note, or I could just sketch it out for you you'll get it and that's what I'm trying to do in my art I'm trying to reach Haiti I'm trying to reach every third world country I'm trying to reach every war I'm trying to reach every kid I learned to love Basquiat because he just did what he felt he didn't do what they looked for because a lot of artists will draw a beautiful picture and the world will automatically think this is an artist that drew this picture because this is what we expect from an artist uh, the world will automatically think a basketball player should not miss any shots because he is a basketball player, NFL player makes touchdowns. This is what you think because this is this person's position. But he gave you not just art, but he gave you himself. He didn't just give you what you looked for. He gave you for what you didn't believe he could get away with. And you began, you began to love it. It grew on you and it didn't just come as everything else cliche. It didn't just come as everything else generic. So that's why I love Basquiat. And he also did music like I did. He also liked to clown. He liked to just uplift the bad. And when he did feel bad, he just lived. He was homeless. And that's the other thing that really touched me to see how he got up and went about the day. He worked, he hustled, and just still came back to his art to find his sanity, to find his peace of mind. 